Hello, my name is Louis. And my name is Timo. We work at 3D Evo and today we have a very special video for you about plastic recycling. It is quite an important topic and we would like to make you more aware, conscious about plastic recycling, also make you understand exactly what it means and also give you the tools to do it yourselves. For example, did you know that by recycling plastic we can save up to 80% of energy compared to making new plastic? Wow, that's really interesting. I actually knew this because you already told me the past 19 takes to make this video. But I actually learned something new today. Thank you, Louis. For example, you told me that it can take up to a thousand years to degrade, right? Uh, that is correct. That is correct. To give you a bit more information, in addition to taking a lot of time to degrade, for example, recycling one ton of plastic could save up to 20 cubic meters of space in landfill, mm. save up to 3,000 liters of crude oil, and mm. save up to 20,000 megajoules of electricity. Wow, there's some really interesting facts and figures. I'm pretty sure Louis can fill an entire video with content like this. But that's not what we're talking about today. Today we're going more into the process of actually recycling plastic and what involves around it. For example, uh, Nowadays, recycling just means throwing your plastic waste into the plastic recycling bin with the little recycling logo on it. And that's the end of your part, right? We've done our part with doing this. But actually, it's a lot more complex than this. There's a lot involved in recycling plastic. For example, for example not everything that ends up in the bin is actually recycled. Quality also degrades of the material. So every time you recycle it, the material breaks down a little and then you have a lower quality part at the end. And how can a lower quality part actually compete with an original part? So there's a lot of things to keep in mind when recycling plastic. But first, let me explain what recycling actually means. So the word recycling stands for recycle, cycle, I'm sorry, a new cycle to an object. For example, this bottle, I can recycle it by drinking some new water out of it tomorrow or I can make use of the opportunity of plastic to melt. So that means I can mold it into a new shape and have a new purpose for this material. But since we're a 3D printing oriented company, we are aiming for some nice 3D prints such as these. Nice shape of the Netherlands. To do this, there's a lot of steps involved, but in this series, we're gonna focus on those steps and everything that involved around it, right? That is correct. This is going to be a series of short videos. There are going to be four videos after this one. And the purpose of all of this is to give you the tools to recycle your plastic waste yourselves. So we're going to go over all of the hands-on steps of recycling. That includes collecting the plastic waste, sorting them, shredding them, extruding them into filament and printing some cool parts. I think that sums up the process, Timo. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up, Louis, and I'm really looking forward to it. Yes, we hope very much that you enjoyed this introduction video. Of course, stay tuned for the rest of the content, the actual explanations, and see you very soon. Ciao. Ciao.